Hi everybody, welcome back to Shotlet Family Firewood. Um, it's, it's been a couple of weeks that I've uh, no real rhyme or reason to what I'm doing. Um, I'm trying to get this tractor done. Um, that's been my, my number one priority. I'm still trying to make some firewood videos. Um, but I haven't haven't put my heart and soul into it like I should. Um, but I got trying to get this tractor done by the last week of August. And I'll show you, flip it around. But I've got um, basically just the sheet metal left and the rear hitch um, on this thing. Uh, got it somewhat wired up this week. Um, I'm waiting on a battery box and a battery to finish that. Uh, but anyway, this Farm All M is getting closer. Uh, it's not not perfect, and I think once it's I'm trying to get ready for a show, it's it's tractor show season in this area. I got one coming up for my tractor next weekend already. Um, and I'm trying to get this one out, getting this farm all out by, uh, Labor Day weekend. So anyway, um, but for firewood this week, um, I cut up the big oak trunk. You'll see that. And I hauled another couple loads of, uh, that oak tree in the dump trailer and a couple of them are the big chunks we dumped out and the smaller chunks uh, that my dad cut up uh, he's kind of inconsistent with the length and stuff so we just put those in the um, in the bin for next year's boiler wood um, so you'll see that uh, and uh, thanks for checking us out um, next couple weeks or a few videos coming up in the next month anyway will probably be tractor show videos. Um, we're going to take a stab at next weekend loading our WD-45. Be the first equipment we're going to try and load in the dump trailer and haul it to the show. So uh, look forward to that. And thanks for watching. And uh, here's this week's video. All right, everybody. Well, I've got a little time today. Uh, it's Friday afternoon. Um, we got to cut up this large oak stump or trunk. We got to cut up this large oak trunk so we can make some firewood out of it. Um, <clears throat> like I said, I got some time. So we're going to try and get through it a little bit. So we'll uh, take you along for that. The only saw that I have that's going to help us with this big trunk is my Neotech NH872. Uh, this is a Husqvarna clone saw, uh, 24 inch bar. And when I cut this down, I had, uh, had the bar buried both directions to get across it. So we'll, uh, we'll be using all of it today. So let's get it fueled up and we'll get to cutting.
right, we got most of that big trunk cut up. Uh, everything should be able to get loaded into the trailer now. Uh, I didn't cut any on this piece here. Um, that one can fit in the trailer. This one is cut, uh, just not all the way through the middle. It gets a little wide here where, where it uh, kind of crotch piece up here. So can't get all the way through that. So I'll have to come up on another route, but I should be able to load that in the trailer too. So, other than that, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those real big chunks. So we'll load them up the way they are, and when we get them home, we'll split them with the uh, with the tree shear on the on my skid loader. So. And my dad's been working on cleaning up the the uh, branch wood and stuff. And he's cut all that up for me. Two little piles of that. So it'll be all of a trailer load. All right, well that filled that thing up fast. We're gonna call that a load. Um, but yeah, that's a pretty big load in itself and we got more than another load here probably, so. I realize it didn't record, but I got a second load this morning. Um, this is all stuff that my dad chunked up. And it's going to be go straight in the boiler wood bin. So Anyway, another pretty good load. Not full, but pretty good. So, well, let's get this home. All right. That was the first time trying this. Uh, got my firewood bin started. Um, got some of these cool eight foot long pallets, um, for, got those from our friend Bob. He's been hooking us up with several of those. It's pretty cool. But, uh, we're going to get this trailer load chucked into this bin here. Um, so yeah, once the pile's filled up, I'll show it to you again. Well, my phone must have got a little too hot or something and quit recording or something else happened. Not quite sure. Anyway, we got this in. Um, trailer's empty and the bin is filled up a little bit. Um, still not sure about the wire for the sides or whatever. That, I guess I learned that from Chris in the wood yard, but oh well. It's working, just not even, but hey, I threw over through a few pieces, so we'll clean that up and, and we'll be done for today.